Hello everyone, here are the latest market news on April 5, 2019. Analysts await for U.S. non-farm payroll. All eyes will be focused on the monthly U.S. non-farm payrolls report, which will provide the latest snapshot of the health of the jobs market and wider economy. This month's report for March will be of particular interest after February's figures shocked with just 20,000 jobs created compared with the 180,000 forecast by economists. The huge miss troubled investors and added to concerns about a global slowdown. Forecasters are expecting a much bigger number today, with payrolls expected to come at 180,000. Another big miss in the figure this afternoon would reignite fears of a downturn. A strong headline figure and solid wage growth will give investors a good distraction from economic slowdown fears. However, the fact is that the economy could be slowing whilst the U.S. labor market remains strong. This is because employment is a lagging indicator, said analyst of LCG. U.S.-China trade deal may be reached in four weeks. U.S. President Donald Trump said on Thursday the United States and China were close to a trade deal that could be announced within four weeks, while warning Beijing that it would be difficult to allow trade to continue without a pact. The two countries are engaged in intense negotiations to end a month-long trade war that has rattled global markets, but hopes of a resolution soared after both sides expressed optimism following talks in Beijing last week. Trump said he would hold a summit with Chinese President Xi Jinping if there were a deal. Goods trade between the United States and China, the world's two largest economies, totaled $660 billion last year, according to U.S. Kansas Bureau data, consisting of imports of $540 billion from China and $120 billion in exports to China. Nikkei touches months high on trade optimism. Japan's Nikkei increased on Friday to a new one-month high as expectations of an imminent U.S.-China trade deal promoted investors to buy back shares they had sold. The Nikkei share average rose 0.38% to 21,807.50, the highest close since March 4. For the week, the benchmark index was up 2.83%, the biggest weekly gain in about three months. The border topics rose 0.35% to 1,625.75. Still, trade turnover was low at 1.95 trillion yen, about 20% below the average, suggesting investors' tepid conviction in the rally. Overseas investors sold a net 857.5 billion yen of Japanese stocks, including cash equities and futures in that week, marking their biggest weekly net sales since October 26, 2018. Elon Musk in clear violation of SEC restraint Tesla CEO Elon Musk and Securities and Exchange Commission, given two weeks to work out an agreement about the billionaire's social media posts as share price falls 8%. The Tesla billionaire Elon Musk is in clear violation of a restraint issued by the US's top financial watchdog after Musk inaccurately claimed last year he had a buyer for the company, a court heard on Thursday. A federal judge in New York heard oral arguments in a lawsuit brought by the Securities and Exchange Commission seeking to hold Tesla's chief executive in contempt for violating a settlement reached last September when Tesla agreed to vet Musk's public communications. The hearing could be the first step in a far more aggressive punishment for Musk, including his removal from Tesla management at a crucial moment for the electric car market's expansion.